This KTM Duke 390 is having an issue with the cooling system. If the bike is switched off when the engine is hot, it is spitting coolant out from the overflow tank. We have replaced this radiator cap too and still the issue is there and I now suspect this thermostat. Air in the cooling system was also bleated out which didn't solve the issue. So I'm gonna now troubleshoot the cooling system by taking the things off. First is the spoiler. The spoiler off from the bike. Next thing is to drain the coolant by loosening this bolt. With that done, we take off the radiator along with the hoses. Radiator is now off from the bike. The thermostat is off, hoses separated from the thermostat. This thermostat functions to regulate the coolant flow between the engine and the radiator. The coolant which is in circulation between the water pump, cylinder and cylinder head is supposed to enter the radiator at a temperature of 88 degrees and that's when this thermostat opens up which opens to shed this line and allows the hot coolant to pass to a radiator for cooling off and if this fails to open that's when the engine overheats causing all sorts of issues in the cooling system. So I'm going to replace this with a new one and check if my problem is resolved. So here we go, finally I have got the problem solved after changing the coolant and the thermostat. I couldn't diagnose the thermostat properly as it is enclosed in this plastic casing. But the coolant and thermostat change has solved my issue.
and there could be another possibility of wrong coolant which might have caused this issue. Previously this was the coolant which was used in this motorcycle. This coolant as it mentions here it is suitable for cars, light duty, trucks, LCVs and tractors. However it is not mentioned that it is suitable for motorcycles and when I asked an automobile guy while purchasing this he suggested me that this can work with motorcycles as well. And the dilution ratio of this coolant is 1 is to 3. I had made the same dilution and this issue was happening. This coolant even after dilution is a bit thicker than the ready mix coolant which the KTM recommends. So the problem could be either in the coolant or in the thermostat. Also the engine used to feel a lot rough with this coolant probably because this is recommended for heavy vehicles. And now the engine runs a bit smooth with this ready to use coolant recommended by KTM. And I'm in no way associated with Motorex or promoting this brand. But this is what I have experienced. I have also made another complete video on cleaning and flushing the cooling system of this motorcycle for which the link is in the description. And with this, I would also suggest you to use the recommended coolant specified by the manufacturer or the coolant which is generally used in motorcycles and not the general coolant which is supplied in the market for LCVs, cars and trucks and definitely not the one which your automobile store guy pushes you to buy. So many thanks for watching and please subscribe for much related content on the repairs.